All right, hello everyone. Um, how's everyone doing? Tonight we'll be playing Pokemon Rejuvenation, as we did last time I started streaming this. Um, since then I've lost or somehow deleted the save file, so we'll be starting over again from the beginning, but I think that'll be a nice change of pace, because we didn't really get too far last time, and I think that starting over will be a nice way to help start things up again. And with that said, um, I think we'll hop right into it. Hop on over to the game screen, and go ahead and boot the game up. Okay. And I right, checked up. Yeah, I'm restarting. Started to do it over again. Okay, we already already got the new save slot. I already checked out the options earlier. So let's go ahead and do Hello? Um, no, we're going to go ahead and do the prologue this time, too. Um, everyone is able to hear me, hear me correctly, right? Like, the audio is good and stuff. Okay, good. Um, so, I guess here we go again. Can you tell me the story about the Zora and the Pangora again, Mommy? <laughs> Alright, I will. I was once a- okay, that's a bit loud. <laughs> that should be a bit better. There was once a lonely Zora living at deep in the darkest forest. He was a mischievous one, transforming other Pokemon beings that lived around. He would often use his ability to trick others into handing over food or using their homes to sleep in. Because of this, he didn't have many friends. I'm sure you can piece together why. One day, this changed when Zora met a powerful Pokemon named Pangoro. They were fighting over a rare and coveted golden apple. Many hours later, the fight came to an end and no victor was revealed. They knew they were evenly matched. One could not take out the other. With both staring at each other intensely, they knew that they were destined for friendship. Two became quick companions, two peas in a pod, if you will. They traveled the world together, overcame hardships, went on thrilling adventures. Life was good for the two of them, till one day Zora took it too far. Zora planned a devious prank on Pangoro. I'll transform into Pangoro's fallen mother. That would surely give him a spook, Zora said. It'll be my best prank yet. So while Pangoro left to find food, Zora would uh, put his malicious plan into action. When Pangoro retreated, he was greeted with the sight of his dead mother. Which paralyzed with a mixture of extreme emotions, Pangoro dropped a collection of food on the ground. In that collection of food was... a golden apple! <laughs> That's right, a golden apple. When Zora saw this, he transformed back into his normal state, looked down at the food and said, Where'd you find that golden apple? It looks fresh and incredibly delicious. Zoro, Zoro raised his head to see a face filled with fury, sadness, and most importantly, disappointment. Zoro quickly realized he had hurt Pangoro very deeply and tried to apologize. But Pangoro wouldn't hear any of it and immediately ran out into the forest. Shaken and worried, Zoro ran after him, but Pangoro was nowhere to be found. Zoro realized that he repelled his only friend with his own selfishness, and Zoro was lonely once more. Sleep tight. Maria. Mm. Morning already. I beg you up. Mm. 
Mama, Mama, Mama. Good morning, Maria. Did you sleep well? I'm preparing breakfast right now. Do you mind fetching your father? He's working in the study. Don't take too long. I don't want his food to get cold. You can count on me. <laughs> this is a picture of me and my family. I love this so much. I remember when we did this. Oh, Mary, uh, Maria, how are you doing? Mom said breakfast is ready, so get your butt out of the room and have good food. I do love your mother's cooking. Alright, I'll be out in a few moments. Go try to tell your mother that, you hear? Dad said he'll be right out. Did he now? I guess there's no use in rushing him. You should go upstairs and freshen up. I'll have your breakfast ready by then. Okay, and then we can go play outside afterwards, right? Of course. Go on, Maria. I'll be right waiting for you down here. I'll be I'm going right now. Oh, I hate it when the world turns green. What was that? Mom? Mom? <laughs> Who are you? How many times? What? How many times are you going to make this little girl suffer? How many times are you going to will- How many times are you willing to put her through this chaos? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not talking to you. Oh. Well, do you know where my parents are? Yeah, they're talking to me. <laughs> Downstairs. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna go find them now. Maria? Yeah? No matter what happens, don't you dare lose hope. <laughs> don't lose who you are, and don't you dare forget what's about to happen. You understand? Yeah, I understand. Good. Now go to them. They're waiting. Okay. These pictures frighten me. Ma? What are you doing? Ma, wake up! Oh god, the music's so loud. Why is the music so loud? <laughs> Hang on. I have this at 8% on my screen. I'm at, on my own volume and it's already that loud. Anyways. Mom, wake up, wake up! Dad, get out of the way, get out! Music wants you to know, yeah? Why don't you say anything? Why? Marionette, your father wishes to see you now. What are you talking about? Marionette, your father wishes to see you now. What are you doing? Marionette, Marionette, Marionette. What? And for the fifth time, Marionette, your father's waiting for the east wing. You make him wait longer than he has time for, so get to it. What? What am I doing here again? Marionette, I won't say it again. Just hurry along. My name's not Marionette, it's Maria. What are we going to do about, you know, the prom injury you told us about? We'll deal with it when the time comes. For now, someone should stop being an eavesdropper and get to their father. Where's mom? I'm sleeping with the Lord now, dear. Stop carrying me, Marionette. It's Maria. What is with this disrespect? Her name is no longer Maria. 
No, I was initially planning to do. No, t no need for explanation, sir. The demonstration may be the, curl to the girl key to the girl's mind. Very well. She's gone now, Marionette. She's with the Lord now. She won't need to suffer the calamity that will soon befall the Earth. Marionette, it's your turn now. No, you can't make me. Maids, bring Marionette to the altar. Let go, let go of me. You stand to sing to mommy. She's gone because of you. Enough, Marionette. Go with dignity. I don't want this. Just let me go. I hate you. Someone, please don't let him do this to me. Someone help me. Anyway, mom. Please. Um, hmm. One second, gotta take care of something. All right, everyone. We have a special surprise tonight. Looks like we'll be joined by one of the moderators in chat in this call. Um, my fr best friend, Nin, will be joining us in the call now. So hopefully everything works well compared to last Monday. <laughs> Can you hear me? I guess not. Hang on. Does B hear me? Let's see. It should work. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Oh shit. Hang on. There we go. That should be that should do it. Let's see, let's see. Is that better? No. Hang on. Oh. Well, I can hear you. Check to see if your Discord is in streamer mode. Yeah, it is. Um, let me disable that. Is that better? Let me talk. Hello. Hello. Let's see. Can you hear me, by the way? I can. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. Okay, everybody can hear us, as I'm being told. Okay, um, good. Good, good, good. Okay, so let's probably, I think we should play on normal mode. What do you say? I guess so. Normal mode. You played intense mode last time, didn't you? No, I think we played on normal last time, but you made me do a Nuzlocke. Oh. That's what happened last time. Oh, that's right. Okay. I think we should play. Yeah, normal. Registration process beginning. Excuse me, can you hear me through this thing? I don't know what Kaya says to give her. Tell her no. Yeah. <laughs> That's better. It's nice to meet you. My name's Amanda. I'm what you would call a scout. For what? The Avium League, of course. It's my job to guide newcomers like you into the world of Pokemon. Before you do, do you need extra assistance? No, I've played this enough times. I could. How would you feel if somebody said, what are the controls to this in just real life? Yes. I would tell them to use your left click. <laughs> God, the game is so loud. Oh, I turned down the game. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn it down too. Double. Turn it down to one, and it's still gonna be enough. What? Mean, the game just wants you to know. 
There we go, and boost it there. Maybe a little bit less. That should be good for the stream. I think. Hopefully. Okay. Fantastic. We should talk about the expectations and requirements of the League. There are 18 gym leaders for, us, for you to defeat. I almost said us to defeat. Amanda doesn't need help in this. <laughs> I'm saying the Elite 8. You heard that right, 8? Pokemon here act a little differently from other regions. They won't obey if you don't think you're worthy. What was that? Oh, I'm just saying Elite 8. Oh, uh, yeah. Are you gonna be worthy, though? I hope so. You can check your stats as a trainer by taking a look at the trainer card. Everything's listed here for you. Speaking of which, we should probably set that up now. Um, let's identify as non-binary. Okay, got it. Um, let's do a personality test. Last time I went with one of the pre-selected avatars, but I think this time we'll just go with whatever we get. What do you think? Yeah, let's randomize it. All right, let's answer some questions. Well, it's mostly going to be me, but we should we can answer them together. I'll just answer them after you answer them. Yeah. <laughs> Accurate answers. All right, let's begin. Or do you want me to answer them? Um. No, we can answer them together. Your friend enters your room and starts jumping on your bed. In this case, that would be you. You'd be definitely be the one that would jump on my bed. I would. Um, let's see. If it was you, I'd probably jump with you. I must enjoy doing on a Friday night. Ironically, it's a Friday. Yeah, <laughs> it's a Friday night right now, and I'm playing a video game. So. A video game. Your friend offers to order you a nice meal for your birthday. Uh, oh, jeez. What would I order? It's my birthday, right? Let's see. I don't know. Probably pizza. What do you think about that? Pizza. Yeah, pizza. A professor. Had great. Yeah, I've I've had it like once or twice, and I haven't been a big fan of it. Your professor puts you into a group and requires a leader. Um, we're alone always. Then nobody would do their work. And yeah. Like, I'd do my part and just take my 20%. Um, I feel like in the past I would look around nervously, but I feel like today I would just act indifferent. Just do it. Yeah. <laughs> you heard a rumor about great treasure hidden deep within a cave. Um, oh, it's a time. Yeah, it's time to tell the squad, get, get a group together. I would share the world. Yeah. At least, I don't know. I would say I would share the world. <laughs> and then. Yeah. All for myself. No, I wouldn't actually do that. I would do it. <laughs> you see a child crying to themselves on a bench in the park. Um, you good, fam? <laughs> um, I'm. I think I'd be the type to cheer them up. Aww. The waitress at your favorite. Yeah. I mean, it's all kind of the same answer. The waitress at your favorite... That's true. <laughs> the waitress at your favorite restaurant finally brings you your food and says, Enjoy your meal! And you accidentally say you too in response. I always say you too. But... Cry, cry and never return. Cry and never return. <laughs> I think I, jeez, I don't know what I would do. Probably not the bottom two. I'll probably just bury my head. Bury your head too. There's someone out. <laughs> yeah, I should, but there's someone at a party who's being too loud and boisterous. It's making people uncomfortable. Um, hey, shut up. <laughs> um, I've been, I've been in situations like this before. I'd probably just leave the party. What do you think? Out noise them. Yeah. <laughs> if you're gonna scream, I'm gonna scream. And I'll scream louder. Um uh, actually if it was making other people uncomfortable. Ah, uh, jeez, I don't know. 
I... Yeah, I'd probably just leave. You made a great achievement. They want to interview you. How do you react? Um... <laughs> respectfully declined. Nah, nah. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> or you see, except with, like, except, but you're also crying because you don't want to accept. Yeah. That's the answer that I would do. Uh, that'd probably be humbly. I think, I don't know. Um, I'd probably do it humbly. It's finally done. You graduated. It was time to say goodbye to your classmates. How'd you say goodbye? <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Um. It's been fun. So long, and thanks for all the fish. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think it's been fun is a good response. Based on the answers given, can only be concluded you are. Oh. It's you. What do you think about this guy? I mean, we could always try again. We just started. Oh, you like him? He's got red hair. That's true. Well, we got that style. Let's go and need a name. Look, he's got flowers all over his profile. You can't tell me that there's not stuff in there. Uh, okay, what should we name him? Okay. Uh, red. red is a good one. How about Rouge? Because it kind of sounds like Rogue. And Rose. You like it? Yeah. R Rouge it is. Alright. Everything seems settled. The biggest fan club. <laughs> Have anything else you want to get done? Um, no, I'm good. Let's get you sell what else can you do? Um, there's actually, I was looking at a walkthrough earlier and there's passwords to like help change the, to help change what your character looks like and also to skip through this prologue. Oh. But we're going to do everything. Kinda. Everything? No, there's one, there's one thing I'm going to skip. <laughs> it's uh, collecting all the little Zygards. You know how you do that in Sun and Moon? Or is that Sun or Moon Ultra? Where you have to go around collecting all the little uh, Zygarde cells. I know that in Sun or Moon you can also do that. Yeah. But I don't think it's a requirement. Yeah, it's not a requirement. Yeah. You can do that in this game too, but it, it takes forever. <laughs> so I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm going to do that for this. I'll see you once you get to East Gear Inn. I'm waiting at the East Gear Inn Laboratory. Don't forget. Save travels, Rogue. I'm gonna keep back flipping between Rogue and Rouge. Do it. Rogue and Rouge. He'll go to one person and be like, my name is Rose. And he'll go to another <laughs> be like, my name is Rouge. Yeah. And then they'll argue with each other. Are you done with your registration? Please come here so I can print out your tra trainer card. You know, I'm looking at our hairstyle. We kind of look like Gary Oak. Well, Gary's name was Blue. So we're almost scary. We're kind of like their, <laughs> yeah. We're kind of like their child. Red and blue's child. <laughs> if we were, then their hair would be purple. That's very true. just takes after red. Yeah. Okay, let's be a quick second. Please be patient. Enter all the credentials. Steal your, steal your identity. <laughs> hey, hiya, Rouge. Your trainer card's ready. We got the trainer card. It isn't verified though. You don't need to verify the gear and immigration. Good luck out there. I'm gonna get verified yet? Hmm. Wonder if Rogue is finished with their uh, registration. We huh. gonna try and get that shiny, or do you not want to even mess with that? Oh god, getting shiny is, is in any game is a pain. It's a bit easier in this one, but no, I think we'll just go with whatever we get. <laughs> For the number one shiny. Yeah. 
There you are, Rook. Did everything go smoothly? Since you're done with the registration, do you mind taking a quick stroll with me? See these doors? When the ship is close to Dock Gate Gear in, a feast will be held within. We still have quite some time before we get to that point. Why don't you go visit my friend Gustus? He's actually the captain of the ship. He used to be a very powerful trainer back in his day, but he's retired now. I'm sure you can find out some neat de details about the Avium region by talking to him. I know it's been difficult ever since we left, but we always not become depressed. Have fun, okay? Explore and meet new people. I have some stuff I need to take care of. I'll meet you down here once I'm finished. Oops. <laughs> I'll see you soon, okay? Don't take too long. Alright. There's not much to do on the ship besides talking to people. And you can just go ahead and skip to talking to Augustus if you want, but there are, there are some goodies to get on the ship. Let's see if I can remember who has it. Uh, yeah, I <laughs> just talked about those seagulls or those wingles. Wingles. I thought they were walking on the ship. Yeah. <laughs> like they're patrolling. Like, what the heck is that? Wingle guards now? <laughs> That'd be amazing. Playing the piano is something I'll never get tired of. I'll never get tired of this wonderful audience. It takes the time to listen to my music either. Um, let's see. I think there's just two other people I want to talk to on the ship before we progress. My doctor's waiting for me, Oceana Pier. It's been a few weeks since I saw her last. I bought her a gift, but the machine I accidentally bought uh, from gave me two. You can have this. We got a rare candy. Level up. Yep. What happens if people do eat a rare candy? They level up. <laughs> the wingle are gorgeous. Just watch the path changes with the wind. Uh, the wind's kind of going circular. <laughs> Sir? Is that one Pocahontas song? Um, I haven't seen Pocahontas since I was like a kid. I don't think. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. I think we're about ready. No, hang on. I gotta see something else first. For some reason, I can't. I can't fix this blasted milk milkshake machine. Blast it all! Wish I didn't have such a dead end job fixing like fixing a milkshake machine. Paul, I told you to fix the milkshake machine. What? That's what I'm doing. That's a healing machine. Way to go, Paul. Fucking Paul. <laughs> what if he made healing milkshakes then, though? God, that'd be amazing. <laughs> Paul would be genius. Paul is a genius. That's what he's trying to do. Healing milkshakes. Alright, I also gotta take care of this. No, it's not in this room. It's in this room? Yeah. This is super weird, but I can hear the people next door through the wall. I'm not going to stop before I eavesdrop. Well, we should probably drop a save. Not that we need to, but it's just good to do it occasionally. <laughs> uh, should we eavesdrop? Heck yeah, we should eavesdrop. Yeah. Hey, goody. Crescent, it's me. May I come in? So, you understand the position you're in, correct? Yeah, I believe so, but if I'm honest, I'm not sure I'm ready. I know what you said about me before, but I genuinely feel fear. Stop talking nonsense. I don't want to hear about fox emo full emotions. All I'm interested in hearing is you tell me you're ready to take the role. I'm sorry, it's my fault, really. I didn't make your position clear enough from the beginning. If you're ready to fulfill your duty, or you're no longer of any use to me, don't get the option to tell me you're ready if you're ready or not. Yeah, Crescent, I understand. I think all I need is a little bit of time. Time is all you have left. All I want to see is Rogue smile. That's all. Once we enter, at, once we dock in East Garen City, you're going to West Garen and live normal lives. If I get even a small inkling of betrayal from you, I won't hesitate to. You don't have to worry about that. I have no plans of doing such a thing. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Now that we're clear on what you have to do, I'm going to ask you to leave. 
The banquet's ready to start, and I need to get ready. I'll be on my way. What a weird conversation. Good thing we don't know either of those two people. But one of them literally <laughs> I think we would know our mother's voice. I think that's about everything we can do on the ship, so I'm just gonna go ahead and progress. You must be rogue, correct? Oh, uh, do you want to do some of the voices? Yeah, my mom is just her name. <laughs> oh no, it's all over again. Uh, <laughs> sure, I can be Augustus. Yeah, okay. Uh, what voice should Augustus have? He's, he's like, old man. yeah, he's an old sea captain. My name is Augustus. Augustus Frank. That's good. I have large delay, okay? So it's gonna be a while. There he is. I am the captain of the SS Ocean. Have you been enjoying your voyage to the avian region? <laughs> Have you been enjoying it? I'd say so. Um, yeah. <laughs> there's a lot to do in avian, so I don't think you'll ever get bored. I can imagine in that Augustus is having these pauses himself. <laughs> it's like, come on, buddy. <laughs> Heard from your mother that you've registered as an official Pokemon trainer. I'm making assumptions over who says next. Usually it's like Pokemon and then trainer. Yeah. <laughs> he says something else. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Do you know what that means for you? Do you know? Do you know? I don't think I do. Well, even if you do know. I suppose I'll have to lay it out for you anyway. Even if you tell me that you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm not going to tell you at all. I'm an old, old man. <laughs> I tell everyone that everything. Because of the size of Avium, there's more than your ordinary amount of gyms. Usually there's only eight. Oh, gym leaders. He got wrecked too, my old man. <laughs> There's a total of 18 gym leaders, and instead of the Elite 4, we have the Elite 8. Try saying that. <laughs> okay. Pokemon also act slightly different in this region than any other region. But we don't have a region lock. Yeah. <laughs> They'll only be obedient towards you if you impress them with your skill potential. Isn't this the same as any other region? Well, um, in in, in other regions, it's only if they're traded Pokemon that they stop obeying you. And they, yeah, it's a good question. How do they know? How did they manage to do this? I have no clue. <laughs> they bred them right. So instead of breeding weak Pokemon, they bred only Yeah. Hmm. Well, you could show off your skill by obtaining lots of gym badges. Lots and, and lots, lots yeah. Of <laughs> 18 to be exact. The more likely Pokemon will be inclined to aid you on your journey. So, you know, the more <laughs> swag you have, the more uh, they'll follow you. Oh, God. <laughs> you can also see what badge you need for certain levels on your trainer card. Of 
requirements are etched on, so you can always refer to that. I know the Gala region, it was like it, you couldn't catch Pokemon over a certain level. Yep. Yeah, um, was that such a long and boring... Oh, now that was such a long and boring, wasn't it? Uh-huh. It sure the hell was. <laughs> was it boring? No. How about we head downstairs and start this banquet? Yeah. I'm not asking you on a date or anything. <laughs> going the same places. Just happen to be. I'm sure all the guests are just dying to see what. Dying of anticipation to see what we are going to show them. <laughs> Interesting what they're Dying. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Just like I'm sure he's dying to get off his ship. <laughs> well, I, well, I think we're ready. What do you think? Is there anything we missed? I say like you I have any clue. <laughs> no. Okay, well, let's go. Yes, we did miss the shiny charm Oh shit! So eager to leave. To eat, that you will leave your poor mother behind. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like us. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm only teasing. Let's get started, shall we? Oh, so she is our mother. So her name is Mom, but she's also our mother. Yeah, that's how it works. Our table's just ahead. The bank wants to, banquet won't start for a few more minutes. Moments. <laughs> well, feel free to wander about until you're ready. I'll be waiting. People are probably like, you know, or like, you know, spoilers and stuff, but that's probably why the ship went down. <laughs> Everyone went crazy because they were so hungry. Yeah. Okay. Um. There's nothing really to do here, so let's just go ahead. Let's get started. Settled. Who's that? Who's that pink guy? Oh, the that's pink. Some ruffles and stuff. That's a Pokemon. <laughs> oh, it is? Uh, that's a shiny Gothitelle. Uh, they're pink in this one? Yeah, they're pink in this one, I guess. So pink. I know. Let's get settled. Greet it. Oh, that's a yo. <laughs> oh. oh, did he say greeting? Yeah. Greeting. Greeting. want you to know it is my pleasure to host this lovely banquet on this magnificent day. It's so beautiful. Look at the wingles. They're just circling around us. We surely won't die here. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> this marks the end of our week-long journey together. You guys waited a week to eat, and now we can finally feast. <laughs> I hope this trip will stay with you in your memory forever. <laughs> Not as like, you know, trauma or anything. <laughs> dying on a ship. Some ominous words there, Grandpa. <laughs> and perhaps one day we shall see each other again. And I was just two days away from retirement. Top 10 anime betrayed. <laughs> and with all that said and done, I'd like the banquet to commence. Uh, sorry, but I'm gonna have to postpone the slow party. <laughs> we want food now. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> she, Crimson makes a good point. What if all the Wingles are just vultures in disguise? Who are you three? What is the meaning of this? 
that'd be pretty funny to explain why they're just walking and shit, <laughs> looking at people. I'm gonna need you all to stay put and listen very carefully. We have explosives on board, and your actor rebellion will result in calamity none you can afford. Let's get through this nice and easy, okay? Sure is an explosive banquet. <laughs> Everyone's just bursting with joy. You're hijacking my ship? Hijacking? No, that's a bit barbaric. We're here to pick someone up. Get Rogue out of here now. Don't make any funny movements. No one's leaving the room here. You hear? <laughs> I said don't move. Get, get them out of here this instant. Got to tell you know what to do. <laughs> Bye. You're all gonna regret well, this. Later. <laughs> later. So we do the peace sign as we go. It's like that one thing. The guy yeah. just fades away from existence. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, aren't you the kid that disappeared out of thin air? What happened to you? Uh, anyway, that's not important at the moment. What's important is getting off the ship. Right after you disappeared, some guy detonated explosive on the hull of the OSS Oceana. Water's gushing at an alarming rate. If we don't find a way out soon, <sighs> that couple with these weird tentacle things. They seem harmless, but they seem to be watching our every move. Are there any survivors? Uh, <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> It's almost yeah, this is tie all over again. It's what? Uh, bravely default that one kid who. Oh, uh, tis, yeah. Everyone that he loved died. <laughs> it is. <laughs> That's a weird parallel <laughs> between the games I've been playing. So I see what's going on. <laughs> it's almost like they're trying to preserve us or look for something. You should go on ahead. I'll stay here and see if anyone needs help. Uh, let's see. I think we need to talk to these guys down here in order to progress the plot. Oh, what's going on? What's happening? Or not. <laughs> Maybe we need to talk to this old lady. What a terrible... This happened last time. What? I didn't know, like, where to go. Yeah. <laughs> what a terrible disaster. Like, Who do I talk to? Just talk to everyone. Oh, now I remember. Oh, my. It's Augustus. I'm so glad you're at sea, you're okay. Have to say your name. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, it's actually, it just cuts off before we can say it. It seems like this perfect day is taking quite the turn. Like it wasn't even perfect to begin with. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I wonder. Hey, Captain, about that food. <laughs> Got all the food going to waste. That's what makes me cry. Yeah, <laughs> that's the real shame here. Huh? What's that? Your mother? I think I saw her downstairs in the food pantry. <laughs> she was horrible. <laughs> She was hoarding it all to herself. Hoarding all of it. That's okay. What we really need to hoard is the toilet paper. <laughs> no, that's too topical. It's exactly why we should talk about it. It's super topical. <laughs> Everyone in the audience can understand. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I, I actually don't know where she is. When the bomb exploded, it knocked me out. Knocked my socks off. <laughs> Captain, your socks. I ain't no captain without 
song. <laughs> he came around, everyone in the room was gone. The I think it's me, it's like everyone abandoned him. <laughs> like, passed out on the floor. <laughs> That's so true. Meanwhile, I'm just thinking, like, the tentacles looking for socks. Tentacles probably, like, wrapped around him, looked at him, and then just left him alone, too. Like, yeah. He's fine. He's good. <laughs> That's so true. Billy the ship as we speak. He's like, he's old. He doesn't have longer to live anyway. It won't be long until the SS Oceana rests at the bottom of the sea forever. Oh, it's becoming a submarine? No, you idiot. Look, I would live in a submarine. <laughs> was a boat turned submarine. I think I'm gonna stay here in my own misery for a bit. He's gonna go down with this ship. He sure the fuck is. He, he's not. There's no... They wouldn't kill people in a Pokemon game. So, I don't know if you've seen the recent Pokemon movies. They kill, a kill, <laughs> they kill Ash every time. They, but they also kill like other Pokemon. There were people at the exit boat looking for a way to stop the water. Like there was this shank that wrapped around his boy in winter, and then he just froze to death. Oh god, I think I remember that. Kimba, or Kimba, the white lion. Yeah. I was traumatized, Ellie. Traumatized. You should speak with them. They've come to see your mother. They could have. <laughs> well, anyways. They could have seen your mother. They came to see your mother. <laughs> it's like they found her. They all came. <laughs> That's... Ugh, there's nothing we can do. We're not strong enough to stop the water from entering. Our Pokemon can't do it as well. Should try to find some life rafts and escape. Should find some flex tape. <laughs> 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 Did you, see that? Did you see the commercials? There? Yes, I have. <laughs> you can stop anything. That's so true. <laughs> hey, wait. Do you see that dark figure in the water? Yeah, it's faint, but I think I can see it, bro. Let go! And they're gone. Oh, no. Kidnapped two people. We should go to the cargo hold to hide. Great idea. You, kid, tell the person blocked the staircase to move it. We need to get down there and hide. Okay. Why do I gotta do everything? Because you're the protagonist. I am the protagonist. Hmm? You can tell that by your anime hair. <laughs> anime hairstyle. I radiate protagonist energy. You do. You probably have a tragic backstory. <laughs> I probably do. Huh? Probably so you don't have a dad. Something started to attack the guests, and now we want to hide in the cargo hold. Uh, I'm not too keen on that idea. Well, if water st starts to enter from above, what do we do then? We'll be trapped, and then, well, you know the rest, don't you? Yeah, we come, be become mermaids. Yikes. Turn into Pokemon that can swim. That's how evolution works. Yes, it's exactly how evolution works. You either evolve or you die. They're back and there's more than last time. Old lady. <laughs> what the? Let go of me. Well, that solves that problem. Oh, it's Deoxys. I completely forgot. Well, yeah, Deoxys it's... I mean, yeah. <laughs> Get all those water fountains. Billy, what are you doing? Playing in the water? <laughs> It's no use. The water can't be controlled. That's way too much damage. That's a lot of damage. It's over 9,000. <laughs> I was thinking more of the flex tape commercial again. Oh. <laughs> Just slap some flex tape over it. Slap a lot of flex tape over it. <laughs> What's wrong, Sylvian? Rogue, is that really you? What are you doing? I thought you, I thought you were somewhere safe. Yeah, about that. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm 100% safe. I'm totally safe. 
I got to be on a submarine. Well, <laughs> all that matters is we're together again, right? The ship won't last very long, Rogue. We're going to have to abandon it. I have a Pokemon we can use to surf off to shore, but as for the other people, they're fucked. Oh, do you want this next person? They're kind of sure, like... I'll take them. They're kind of like a... Hot, like a... Uh, high and mighty secretary type. What makes you think that you're safe from our onslaught? That yeah, that's good. Oh my god, she just came in. I know, she's just teleported. For one purpose and one purpose only. How do you teleport like that? What's the. Yeah, 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 teach me! Yeah, teach me! And we're not leaving until we fulfill that porpoise. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Are you the one that's behind us? Obviously, as I'm behind you, or I was until you turned around, perhaps it's a possibility, but that's not something I'm comfortable with, with sharing right now. You yeah. still need 20 more levels to understand <laughs> the magic. That's so true. The only thing that truly matters right now is your apprehension. Why does she want your apprehension? a good question. <laughs> My apprehension? Sounds vaguely rude. I can just see it in my head. <laughs> I need your apprehension. apprehension. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's correct. Did you think Rogue was our target? Meanwhile, Rogue is just like running around. It's like, teach me, teach me, teach me. Jump on the boxes and then jump on top of her. Yeah. <laughs> Those boxes are higher than she is. Was the target our mother all along? I don't know. Maybe that's what they made you think. But that couldn't be further from the truth. It was me, Dio. <laughs> if all you wanted was me, why'd you go so as far as to destroy the SS Oceana? Why do I have to keep referring to things in first person, in full title? Why didn't I just say the ship? You've endangered all these innocent people. I have no idea what's going on. The SS Oceana was an ugly ship. <laughs> it had to go. The captain didn't even feed people for a week. <laughs> Witnesses can be such a bother. What's better if we just wiped them all out? And if someone happened to get out, they could spread awareness. This feels like a, a schoolyard fight. I know, right? Like, you know, there's not a hundred people drowning in the <laughs> hole right now. Assuming anyone got out, which they won't. Duh. <laughs> It's like, uh, no one's going to get off the ship. Uh, 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 I have teleportation magic. <laughs> this is exactly what it's like. It's like when you go play with someone that they're like, I teleport behind you. <laughs> That's the heart. You die. She summons Mary Sue O.C. Yes. That's why she's got purple hair. That's exactly why. And she can teleport. It'd be too bad considering most people think we're quite passive anyway. Because if you mind control all those people. Yeah. No, but yes. Yes, but no. It's time <laughs> for people to wake up with the dream of safety they have going on. Wake up, sheeple. <laughs> Chris makes a good, another good point. Like, just like a hundred people on the ship and then none of them had surf. Or dive. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe all their, they had to eat their Pokemon. Oh God! <laughs> like, like, I'm just saying. That's true. We haven't seen any Pokemon besides the Wingles. 
It's going down like this, huh? Sylveon, return. Rogue, I want you to take care of all my Pokemon. They can help you escape. Oh, okay, because as long as I know you're safe and sound. Sylveon return if she's going to do this Pokemon? That's, you know, that's a really good question. <laughs> Sylveon will probably be better outside the Pokeball. <laughs> that's all that matters to me. It's unfolding right here now. <laughs> Sorry, can't do it. That's not going to happen. Hand over the balls. To <laughs> My God, don't think you're safe. I'm going to deal with you next. Rouge, Rouge. How are you say your name? <laughs> it's pronounced Rogue. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Now it's like a Y. Like, bro. Thank you. What was that? Look out below. What the? <laughs> you better appreciate me, Rogue. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna keep calling them that. Rogue. Pushing, pushing a pin, yeah, that's her name. That's her, her that's her given name. Character. Pushing a pin off the side wasn't as easy as I, th I thought it would be. Sounds of a piano crashing on the floor. That was a song dedicated to you. I don't even know if it was worth it in the long run. Can you escape here by yourself? But it doesn't matter anymore, does it? Try to escape this place, kid. Make a note of it, kid. Because it looks like my time here's up. Run for your life! <laughs> Dad? <laughs> Dad? Where do you think you're going? Our dad is actually at the office. <laughs> that explains so much! Our hair is red. We have such a tragic backstory. Did you think you were done with moi? <laughs> Are we done with them? Like, are they gonna come back? What? <laughs> Little child, it come with us. There's no point in fighting back. Just slap her. <laughs> you imagine if like people are like, fight me, and so you just start throwing punches at them, and they're like, no, no, Pokemon battle. <laughs> yeah. It's like, fight me, and you just pull out a gun. <laughs> oh my god, make things worse for you in the long. No, just give one of the Pokemon a gun. So, complete log What the? <laughs> Bye, bitches. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. We'll deal with them later. <laughs> now what do we do? Same thing we do every night. <laughs> the SS Oceana is done for. If we stay any longer, we'll be dragged into the depths with them. That's, I'm guessing it That's pretty close. That's pretty much it. Get out of here now. <laughs> the child plane stole us to feed it to it, feed us to its babies. Oh, no. It's just one tragedy after another. I uh, again. What was the Jurassic one where he was? I think it was the second one, right? Jurassic Park two. I I haven't seen any of the Jurassic Parks. What? Zoe. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know you anymore. <laughs> hey, we made it to chapter one. Well, we've already been shipped. Why is it shipwrecked now? That's a... <laughs> ship. 
<laughs> well, we made it chapter one. <laughs> Do we start with the Pokemon then? Like, what happens to our mom's Pokemon? Oh, uh, they're still on her, unfortunately. Oh. She would. Like, she tried to hand them over, but the Deoxys got in the way. Oh. Which is a shame. Then... But she do end up getting her Pokemon later on the story. Okay. I was gonna say, what if they were crushed by the piano? That would absolutely suck. And make me cry. Um. Let's see. I think I'll do this one. Town Flame, you find anything? I don't know why I'm making everyone country. <laughs> oh dear. Are you okay? You were on the SSO stand, weren't you? Rogue explained what happened. <laughs> Just take our word for it. I see, so that's what happened. I saw most of what happened go down. I tried my best to get out there as fast as I could. Fortunately, my trusted talent flame is fast. I got out there just in time to rescue you. I haven't introduced myself. My name's Sesla. Unfortunately, the ship. Sus. What? Sus, yeah. That is a little oh, suspicious. I it's Sesla. Oh. Like suspicious. No, her name's Tesla. Oh, okay. Okay. Unfortunately, the, sh the ship is sunk to the bottom of the ocean. I wouldn't worry too much, though. That's only a couple of people. <laughs> I'm sure your mother will be fine in the long run. <laughs> she didn't actually say that. <laughs> I just I improv'd. Improv'd that. Only a couple of people died. Only a couple of people died. Yeah. <laughs> team, yeah. Team, team Zen aren't exactly the most competent group out there. Is this your first time hearing of them? They're a criminal organization no one really knows much about. They usually all bark and no bite, so this is pretty shocking. I wonder if, or if whatever they're, they're planning has finally gone into action. Anyway, you're all alone now, aren't you? Well, if you aren't, don't mind me asking, what do you plan to do now? I'm gonna go to the lab. That's a wonderful idea. Maybe you'll be able to get your own Pokemon there. You'll need one if you're gonna be traveling around Avium. I think I'll go ahead to the wreck site, see if I can find any more survivors. I'm a firm believer that everything happens for a reason. Things, things will work out eventually if you're patient. Before I leave, what's your name? Rogue? Rouge? Whatever? <laughs> All right. Oh, you are. All right, Rouge. We'll see each other soon. Clear the way. It just runs over us. Knocks you into the water. Yeah. No, you later. <laughs> we'll speed ahead, Town Flame. Tailwind. Why didn't they just turn around and go the other way? Like, look at all that space behind them. You yeah, know, that's a really good point. <laughs> um, I don't think we can do anything without our starter Pokemon. So let's go ahead and grab that. We should try. We should start try. Without your starter Pokemon. You new around here, kid? You okay? What's with long, long face? Yeah, just punch I him. <laughs> Alright, gear and head. Gear and just up ahead. Well, I mean, we can try. We can punch a bird. Little talon flames over here. Don't come this way. I'm feeding the fletchlings. Fine, whatever. Hang on, I got an idea. I think I may be able to solve the, um, hang on, <laughs> solve the lag by doing this, start a screen share. Oh, why do you want to screen share? This way we could, you could, we can read the lines faster just in case. Oh, look at Zoe being so smart. Hey, do you want to just like uh, get on another ship and leave? Yeah. Oh, so see, are you tired of your boring life? Uh, yes. I, yeah. My most boring is life. I can't believe the boring day I just had. <laughs> <laughs> I slept, I shat, yeah. I'm here. <laughs> In that order. order. Yeah. <laughs> of course, of course, listen to what I have to say. You're the luck lucky thousand per person to talk to me today. Which means you get an all expense paid trip to the luxurious and tropical Hoenn region. But don't tell it, I'll just offer long last as long as you're talking to me. The moment our conversation ends, my offer ends. What do you say? Are you interested? Yeah. Yeah, I want to go. Give me a few months to cover something with my supervisor. <laughs> if you hold up. 
this I've never I've never done this before. <laughs> Hold on. If you leave now, things will go unsolved. Free trip, free trip. Free trip, free trip. Your mother, everyone who lives in the region, they're all, all fall victim. Whoever lies evil lies within. I really just got <laughs> I guess you made your choice. I mean so have fun hoeing. Let's get ourselves on the sea toward hoeing. Please tell me. Shit as well. <laughs> Audibly yelling, ooh, free trip! Left everything 90% behind in pursuit of Tropical Getaway in Paradise. Oh. Like that tropical, though. oh, God. I would have looked back with longing and regret. I'd be free trip, free trip! Only a shrug yeah, off the way. Right. <laughs> Pina colada and ice cream cold soup. Sea salt caramel ice cream. God, that does sound good, though. That's so the PPA avium. They found crutches of wherever lie beneath shadows. Nothing but ruin and destruction. Wish you here, Rouge. Please tell me that gives us a game over screen. The best ending. <laughs> <laughs> it's not game over, it's game one. Oh my god. <laughs> We are not. No! <laughs> Just a few Loop now. Too late. Try again. I can't. But now the save file knows I tried that. It's like Undertale. What? Oh, really? I think so. I didn't save. So I think it loaded it on that. Hey, I need Arena. I do. We can catch it later. Oh god. I'm so, oh god. I'm so. <laughs> I didn't expect that to happen. Well, it happens. We did it. We won. Hey, we got an achievement <laughs> for wandering around aimlessly. <laughs> Welcome to Avium Immigration. Have your passport? No passport? Boys, we got another one. You're illegal. Now you gotta be thrown in the pokey camp. Yeah. This simply won't do. I have a trainer card. Those can double as passports. That's what they say. Sure you do. Please come with me. That's not... Didn't they say before that you'll still have to register with the people? Yeah, that's what we're doing now. Right now? Yeah. Okay. Could you verify... It's a smoothie machine. That's a, <laughs> it's a milkshake machine? Yeah. Yeah. Could you verify and renew this young trainer's card? You know what will happen if it's not verified. I don't want to know what will happen. I just got just thrown off a ship and onto another one. I sure do. This will only take a second. There. All verifying ready to go. Real... <laughs> what if it's... What if it's... <laughs> what if they misspelled it on the trainer card? <laughs> My god. I hate it when they do that. Y'all spell it like... Instead of rogue, it's... Rouge or yeah. something? Yeah. <laughs> Raj. Raj. <laughs> Raj is now verified sitting in Wavium at the moment. Thanks, sis. Here you go, Rug. You can have, have this back. I got a trainer card. Here you go, Rug. Rug? <laughs> <laughs> That's the best one so far, I think. You can now roam Wavium without any restrictions. Good luck out there. God, I'm so glad we named our character this. Uh, you want to do Amanda? Sure. Oh, hi there. Are you right? <laughs> yeah, that's a real country boy. Yeah. <laughs> what took you so long to get here? I thought you ditched me. Well, now that you're here. We can get started. Just choose from these one men. They'll be your life partner forever. This guy? You talking about this guy? In the air for you. <laughs> ever want to think to make things seem less? And you ever want to make things less cinematic in your life? What the fuck are you talking about? I think so. What, what important things happen? Something like this will happen. What did you do to my eyes? <laughs> <laughs> he holds a like black eye <laughs> in your face. Understand now? Everything look like we're not everyone likes things, so it's like to be less cinematic. No, I'm good. I like things cinematic. Zoe likes the 
drama. I do like the drama. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Oh, look, a person with green hair. And she's asleep. Sitting next to her in spirit. And... Yeah. <laughs> Yippers. This new trainer is final here. Who the fuck was that? He just walked past us. Another purple here, guy. Look at all these anime protagonists. <laughs> Yeah. Right this way, Rogue. Right this way. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Amanda. Uh, oh. And where have you been? I've tried getting in touch with you for weeks now. Why haven't you gone back to me? Also, that hat's new. Did you buy it on your trip to Grand Dream City? God, Grand Dream City. That's gonna be a trip when we get there. You know, I've always been busy and stuff. And yes, I bought this hat at GDC. Stylish, ain't it? While well, you've been busy shopping, I've gone ahead and finished our project. I need to deliver, go ahead and deliver her to Zoomy for me. She's presently starting up Magnolia Library. Oh, you know, I would, but I'm sorry Betty was rude. Another new trainer, I see. Jan. Jan, yeah, uh, here's a fun, a fun fact. This Jan is actually modeled after the Jan that created this game. Self-insert. Yep. Nice to meet you, Rogue. I'm Amanda's brother. Yep, my bro here co-manages the lead with me. If by co-manage, you mean Jan does all the work while Amanda plays outside, then yeah, I do co-manage. <laughs> you know I'm better with more hands-on stuff, Jan. Plus, you're better at being prettier behind the screen. You're better with paperwork, I mean. <laughs> I mean, honestly, it's such a good idea to pin me with all the legal documentation the league requires. I suppose you're right. If I left you with that stuff, you should be sure to make everything burn to the ground. Anyway, since you're not willing to deliver this myself this for me I will myself okay you do that I'll see you two later Easy as right back to business I'll meet you inside the actual lab okay here we go oh god it's her uh, I'll take her Owie, sorry about that. I'm in a rush. Please excuse me. I will not excuse you. <laughs> You're not excuse- <laughs> How dare you. This way. And, uh, what's the- Let's see, who is this? I'll just do it. And above all else, make sure she's there for pickup. I assure you the things have already been set in motion. Professor Jenner? I brought the new trainer as you requested. <laughs> oh, Amanda, I didn't think you'd get here so soon. So soon? We're technically late, Professor. In any case, welcome to my lab, Rogue. I'm the lead scientist here at Gear lab, lab. I was hired by Jan and Zumi. Professor, you always put the trainer to this lengthy, long-ass introduction <laughs> that nobody wants to hear. I suppose you're right. In that case, please take Rogue and help them choose right away. Oh man, this is the best part. Let's go! Uh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Did no, you God. No, I just. I keep forgetting. We have a lot for you to choose from, but I won't explain too much. You're a big boy <laughs> or girl, and I know that you can choose for yourself. I think it's a better experience for you to take a look at yourself anyway. Oh, and don't worry, we have you being indecisive in mind. If you can't decide on a Pokemon to choose, you may leave your fate up to the RNG gods and use the random machine. As it implied, it drops a Pokemon you could choose here at random. Good luck! All right. Are you sure the random machine instead, or you want to pick? No, I feel like... <sighs> Like like we were discussing earlier, I think a Charmander looks would be good. Plus, it just looks 
Looks good with how our character looks. Yeah. You gonna be fire? Joe Starmander. Oh god, what should we name it? Uh, it's a boy. It's a boy. Boy! Why not name it? I don't know, I'm thinking like orange. <laughs> yeah. Why not call it tangerine? Or mandarin? Hmm. Mandarin Whoops. What do you think? Crimson suggests Blaze. What do you think about that? You don't like Blaze? Blaze? What do you, you like it? Yes, the name is on fire. Okay, Blaze. We'll go with Blaze. Let's check out Blaze's stats. Whoops, wrong button. Oh, oh god, but those... Stats? No, the stats are amazing, but that ability sucks. What ability? Oh, solar? Yeah, solar power. Oof. Why is the HP decrease? I think we should re-roll. Okay. Yeah, let me see if I can remember what the command is to reset the game. No, I can't. <laughs> it could be. We did it. We did it. Alright, let's try this again. I think before we realize that Alt F4 also deletes all our save data. <laughs> That'd suck, absolutely. Alright, let's try this again. Solar power again. You gotta air your screen with me again, Zoe. Whoops. Okay, I'll do that as soon as we can. I'll do that as soon as we get one that looks good. So that I don't have to keep closing it. Is that good? That solar power again. Yep. Oh, still not good enough for you? Nope. Should be my SMH head. Okay, this is good. Find a good one? Yep. Look at that. If you boy. There we go. Every everything good? Yes. Okay, good. We're gonna go ahead then. We'll just run away with it. Yeah. Please. We don't need her. What well, rogue, where are you going? Away. <laughs> I got my Charmander, I'm leaving. Hell yeah, Charmander. nice choice, Rogue. Oh, that's you. Yamander. Hell yeah, boy. That's a nice choice, Rouge. At least, it looks like a nice choice. Let's see if it actually is one. And of course, by that I mean a battle. Don't worry, I won't use my actual Pokemon for this. Yeah, just she like throws out her level 100 or so. <laughs> That'd be <laughs> against you. Does she always have a litten? Yeah. I think so, anyways. Figure it is yet. I know I am. All right, Blaze. Hopefully, we'll be able to do this. <laughs> it doesn't really matter if we lose this or not, but it'd be good to win it. Um. Let's start off with a scratch, see how things go. That's good. Okay, it seems pretty even. Let's keep it up. You go first, though. If it comes down to it. Okay, we're a little bit lower in HP department, but I think we should be able to manage. Get a critical hit. You know, in retrospect, we could have used that rare candy. We should have used that rare candy. We should have used that rare candy. <laughs> Wanna restart? <laughs> no. Uh well right now, make blaze level up. No, we can't use it in battle. battle. Let's use growl. That's not part of the game command cannon. You can't use rare candies in battle. Well <laughs> I believe in the zone. 
No. Blaze. I guess we should have done growl first and then scratched him. Probably, yeah. <laughs> well, we can learn from this. It's not like we're doing a Nuzlocke. We are doing a Nuzlocke in my heart. <laughs> Ah, hang on. Okay. His screen froze. Ah, don't worry about it. You'll learn from your losses. Jeez, thanks, Amanda. Did she take your money? Which you will have. It's inevitable, and frankly, the possibility of losing makes things more interesting anyway. If you say so. Anyway, that was a good battle through and through. There's a little something for me to get you started. Yeah, oh, Pokeballs. Thanks for the balls, Amanda. Oh, and I'm sure these will come in handy as well. The heck so you just take your ball. Yeah, I sure have. We sure did. Got those running shoes. <laughs> and a word from our sponsor. Oh, this is just how to use. Yeah, it's just, uh, how do <laughs> That's exactly how I do it. No, we don't need to read that. That's all for me for now. But Professor Jenner should get you all situated. Maybe he's gonna give you a big old thing first. <laughs> Fargo, let me heal up your Pokemon. Should be later, y'all. Their name is Blaze. <laughs> See you later, Rouge, and good luck on your journey. Here she go. Shutter's reactivated. No, I want more! I know, right? Just no click through it. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, Rogue. Your journey's just beginning. But that aside, I have something personal to ask you. Uh, Professor, we just met. It has to do with... <laughs> oh, you can take this guy. He's like the happy-go-lucky rival. All right, let me think of a good voice from him. Professor Jenner, I'm back from my trip. Amethyst is kidding me. <laughs> the cave. Here's a Pokemon you lent me. Ah, oh, Ren, you got back quickly. Yep. I got research on all the Pokemon you requested to see. Because I'm teacher's pet. <laughs> I told you that hiring me as your assistant was a good job. I get the job done. Look at that. Oh, who's this? A new recruit? A new friend? <laughs> Not a new recruit, but a new trainer. So, you're a new trainer? Alright then, if that's the case. Let's see how you do in battle. I don't wanna. Thrown down like Radisson or <laughs> like death. Yeah. Oh boy. Beginner luck quickly runs out. I didn't have that to begin with. Let's start off with growl. Let's learn, let's learn from my mistakes. And before he one shots us. God, that be that suck. Okay, I think we're good. I think starting off the growl was a good idea. I have all the good ideas. Yep. So you should always listen to me. <laughs> You're the one that told us to go on the ship to Hoenn. <laughs> and got us our first game over. Oh god. Oof, I lagged a lot, so I think I missed a lot. It's okay. Whoa, not bad. Not bad at all. I should do Gary's voice. <laughs> wow, well, I didn't think you get loose. You're really good at this. Is that in a sneer in it? 
Professor Jenner usually lets lend me his Pokemon so I can take a more dangerous thing. Cool. Dangerous than you. <laughs> Speaking of which, I already have another task for you if you're ready. Oh, do you mind if I take on a task a little later? I promised the friends that I'd meet up with them after I came back. You've done a great job so far, so I suppose you can have the rest of the day off. Thank you, sir. I'll see you tomorrow. Wink. <laughs> Smell you later, Rude. We'll see each other soon, I'm sure. About that personal favor. I have a daughter named Melia. I sent her to Route 1 in Goldenwood Forest a little while ago. I have faith she'll be able to take care of herself, but I'd feel better if there was someone to look after her. <laughs> of course, I won't let you do this without a reward. Please take these as payment in advance. The CyberNav is a device similar to the Pokey Gear. You can check the town map and listen to music while traveling. There are other apps, ab may other apps available for as well, so be on the lookout. You can go now. Yep, I sure did. Oh, Rogue, just the person I was hoping to run into. Would you mind coming with me for a moment? A couple things I would like to show you. Okay. I seem not like we have a choice. Well, Rogue, this is where we keep all the good stuff. There are numerous... What? Oh, never mind. <laughs> there are numerous amounts of gadgets laid across the region that will aid you when you first find them. Exhibit A. You just takes you to a giant letter A. It is exhibit A. A. Here's what we like to call the PC Star. These machines act as a re remote PC storage system. Come across these things, you'll be able to access your storage. Pretty simple. Now for exhibit B. This one's pretty important. This is the gym guide panel. When you enter a gym, you'll see one of these panels. They're usually by the entrance. When activated, a special person will appear and give you advice on the gym leader you're about to face. Once you defeat the gym leader, the panel will no longer operate. Not like you need advice for a gym, gym leader you've already defeated. And finally, Exhibit C. They made this something really big. They could have made it like, yeah, you can put in your own advice now. That would be interesting. This is what we call a healing star. Pretty sure this one's self-explanatory, but I'll mention its use regardless. There are two types of healing stars. Red are one-time use. They will deactivate and won't reactivate until you white out. Gold healing stars can be used indefinitely. Additionally, upon whiting out, you'll come back to the station. Really handy if you ask me. Well, that's why all I wanted to show. Feel free to try out any of these things before leaving. I have a lot of work to do, so I gotta go. Good luck on your journey. <laughs> How do I steal things? Yeah. You pick it up and you put it in your pocket. I yeah, we need to heal. Can you heal? Look at that. What's that yellow one for again? It heals indefinitely. The reds are just one time use. Why would you make one that's indefinite and then one that's one time? That's uh it is it is a little bit. But it's just to make Can you the put it the computer? Uh this computer? No, the one that was up there. Oh, that up the there. Hallway. Yeah. Did you run? Yeah, I'm running. Ah, da, 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 da. All right. You can't use the computer. Oh god, it's raining. <laughs> That's so bad for police. It's been raining like every time that I watch police. Yes. <laughs> in this city, it's raining. I think you're right. That's just the luck of the draw, though. <laughs> Um, it shows you how unlucky I am. No, I think it's me. Alright, now we take Charmander to Holland. Yep. <laughs> and Charmander can sit. He can oh, sit. he just crossed the hey, whole road for you. <laughs> He's like, I'm coming for you. Wanna come to my place? No. 
Is he kidnapping you? Yeah, kinda. Is this being kidnapped right now? <laughs> you don't wanna come with me? Let's do a Pokemon battle. If I win, you gotta come with me. No! A 50% chance of hitting, and of course it hits. Sleepy, and he's so sleepy. He's so sleepy. Oh, You're gonna be like one hit point. <sighs> okay, he's back up. Yeah, I see what you mean. Hit again. Yeah, the defense. Yeah. What like Charmander has to like fight in the rain. I know, I was just thinking that too. In the rain. I was just thinking about that too. I just to live. need to live. God, this this is this is a, definitely a thing. Okay, good. Whew. Oh God, there's another one. Oh, we learned Amber. Finally, set him on fire. I can try. Might as well. Oh, well, that did about. <laughs> it's because it's raining. Oh, yeah. Rain dampens. The fire. The fires of your flames burn yep. hotter. Finish it off with a scratch. Did you hear what he just said? Or see what he just said? Yeah. He said, don't be like that, baby. Oh, not even his baby. <laughs> we're, not, we're not even babies. SMH. Wait, do you have to pay Pokemon people in this one? No. That would suck. <laughs> I don't think I've ever run a... I don't think I've ever run across a game where that's the case. I mean, Digimon. Digimon had it where if you wanted to deal with your guys, you had to pay. Uh, okay. Might as well run into other houses. I can't. Uh, I pre like you just kind of like battle. All the floors I feel except the second one. I do hear rumors about that second floor. Don't mind me, it's not my place to talk about strange things. If I remember correctly, it's a pottery seal. Let's check it out. That's right. Catch him. Befriend him. It is a pottery seal. You have to get food though, right, for it? Yeah, I have to get food first, I think. Let's check. Nidoran. Yeah, we need food. Yeah. You want the pottery seal or you want the Nidoran? Oh god, that's a good question. Oh god, what do we do? Patrick, we did. I do like Nidoran. First, we need to even find the food. What if we got two? Oh, look, it's not raining anymore. So every time you go in and out, it like switches. Rain and then unrain. Rain and then unrain. Oh, grass. Well, let's get into another fight. Actually, let's see what these people say. Did you hear about the association? It hasn't come in yet. What? The lighter is supposed to connect to Unova and Iridium? Well, this was supposed to come in hours ago. Supposedly, I heard it was intercepted by Team Zen. That worth this group of people? <laughs> yeah, sure. It's true. Team Zen may be docile, but it seems like it's starting to become more active. That's true. I'm leaving. Can't live in a, in a, with, live in a region with a bunch of terrorists. You are bad. You look weak. Gee, thanks. You only look weak, but you're actually strong. Yeah, that's, that's a good way to look at it. Jeez, Ember, burn that bitch. <laughs> uh, well, we got this in the bag. Oh, Pidgey. Oh, 
Oh god, I thought that was gonna finish it. Please, you're not strong enough yet. What the heck? I was supposed to win. Alright. Let's see. What else can we do? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Um, is this a foot trainer? Yeah. <laughs> Is this... or foe. One of these days, you're gonna get in a fight with someone and you won't be able to use your Pokemon. You'll only be able to use your fist. <laughs> and then what does it mean? Probably gonna get our ass handed to us. I think we can't be in the Pokemon. <laughs> oh, especially if it's like, I don't know. Oh, actually, I don't know about Spearow. I don't think I can beat up a spear with my fist. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> Yeah, like I think so. Oh god. What? Oh no. It's got bubble us to death. <laughs> Shit bubbles. I no, please! We were so ill prepared. You have like three Pokemon on us. You got your Pokemon, Zoe. Run in the grass. Okay. I see him. Like, yeah, let's try, let's try to go catch some Pokemon. I don't know what, oh, what's in the grass here, but I know there's some good stuff. And in the, in the lurk. No, that'd be great, though. Wait, really? Um. Let's see. If you go in the grass, like, uh. Right behind that one lady? Right next to the creepy guy? <laughs> or do like every place is different? Oh, an orange berry! Let's see. No, not every place is different. I think this grass and that grass should be the same. Well. <laughs> purloin. Look, see, this purloin sitting down. I was just saying that because the most recent purloin shows it standing up. Yeah, I know what you mean. It, I, that is weird. It's kind of like Meowth. Dead. You killed it. Whoops. You're too strong. I'm too strong. You're at that weird point where you're too strong to catch Pokemon. <laughs> but too weak to get past the train. Yeah. <laughs> this is where the cool kids hang out. Does that mean you're a cool kid? Yeah. Look at that. She's enthusiastic. See, I could bet I could beat up a Pidgey with my fist. You think? Pidgeys are the nicer ones. Honestly, I only say I can't beat up a Spiro because I've been like, I watched that Pokemon thing. The first yeah. episode. Yeah. Spooks. All right. Let me just, let's see, let's see. A bicycle shop? Buy a bike. Buy a bike, buy a bike. Why get running shoes when you can buy a bike? For $9,999,999. Easy cash, honestly. <laughs> yes. Sorry, you're too poor. <laughs> well, damn, Didn't he's got us there. Time is money. Money is mine. Oh no. Our greatest ever enemy. What sort of Pokemon do you think we should try and find? Pikachu. Pikachu. Yeah. Giant Charmander. <laughs> uh, as soon as we find the snack machine, we should be able to catch that Pachirisu. Oh, oh, oh my goodness, I'm sorry. I thought you wanted the Nidoran. Oh yeah, I forgot we were doing that. SMH though. 
shaking my SME chair. There's <laughs> some grass types we can catch in this area. Can you catch like other starters? You can, right? Um, I think that you get them through like side quests and stuff. Oh, I was gonna say if you could try to hunt for a Bulbasaur. Um, well, let's see. We might find one. <laughs> you never know. Why does it sound like there's like a club? Should we have two fire types? God. <laughs> Should we? <laughs> Should we? All fire types will never pass like any gem. Oh, they the f <laughs> blaze into the pants here, ate some grass. He wants to set the world on fire. Actually, I think if you use the move Incinerate, the field sets on fire. Oh, really? I think so. One of the fire type moves. Ooh. That's a grassy terrain healing the Pokemon. That's just what grassy terrain does. Why? Are they, like, <laughs> rubbing the grass on their wounds? I guess. <laughs> okay. Um, do you think I should pull up a walkthrough? I think show us the forbidden secret. Yeah, I mean, you're, you guys aren't gonna see it, but I'm gonna, I'm going to, <laughs> and then we'll make judgment calls. Let's see. Yeah. Um. So how's your day been going? While I'm looking for this. Uh, sleepy. Sleepy. I started a new show actually. On what? Amazon. Oh, what show? Tales from the Loop. I think it's called sci-fi interesting sad show everyone dies not really but uh it feels that way hmm okay so i did a blue bit reading i found where we can get the first pokey snack so we can pick up that neater in if we wanted Ooh, let's do it it's right here Someone just threw that in the bush? <laughs> yeah. I hate it when it's raining. Oh god, it's not gonna stop raining. Oh god, it's always raining. It's always raining. We're always sad. Alright, should we give the Neater and the Gourmet treat? Maybe it'll just join us instantly and we won't have to find it. Neater wants to play. Yeah, we'll play with it. It yeah, torch. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> play, like, fetch or something. Why could we like, just play fetch? I forgot. <laughs> oh, I say throw a Pokemon now. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> Easy. Alright, what should we name it? Sons of boy as well. Maybe we should start naming them after like the Jonas Brothers. <laughs> boys night, boys night. Boys night, boys night. Um, what about calling this one like Link? Why Link? <laughs> Because Legend of Zelda. I, yeah, I get that, but what's that have to do with a Nidoran? Nothing that is like Legend of Zelda. That's fair. Ooh, it's got a good ability, too. Its stats are a little bad, but we can deal with it. Do you think we should? We could, st we could still re-roll, re try and catch it again. Yeah, sure. Here we go again. Time warp. We're stuck in a time loop. Tales from the loop. <laughs> it's haunting me. 
most recent episode I watched, though, this guy almost crushed his daughter with a robot. Oh, God. <laughs> That's all I'll say about that episode. Because I think you should watch it, too. Yep. Very good. It does sound interesting. You know, I could have healed. <laughs> like, I, ha I had another opportunity oh, to heal. <laughs> Restart. Well, and look. now it's in the green instead of the yellow. That's a good thing. It means it has a higher defense. Oh, yeah, I guess that's true. I'll think about it a bit. I think more like, you know, it's green, so now I'll have to hit it again. And if I hit it again, I'll kill it. That's true. <laughs> Let's just keep trying our luck. All right, we caught it on the second ball. Hopefully it, hopefully it has a good ability. Let's just call it Link again. I like it. You like Link? Yeah, sure. Hmm, interesting. What do you think of that ability? I think most Pokemon seem to be a boy. That's true. Let's keep it then. So it's a good one. Is it a good stack? Yeah, good. Okay. It's uh, as long as the attack is good, it should be fine. You know, I can never tell with that. Well, it's just with, like, with all with, high numbers. Yeah, but this, it, I think it pre, I'm pretty sure it goes on a scale of one to thirty-one. So twenty-two is really good. Got twenty-one special attack. Yeah. So if it learns any special moves, it can use those too. All right, let's go heal. <laughs> so I'm gonna look at the walkthrough again. Tell me more about this show, Tales of the Loot. Loot is it loop or loot? L-O-O-P. Okay. So is it like, uh... Tales from the Loop. Yeah. Um... It's on Amazon. It's a, I, don't, uh, well, I don't know much about it, but the, the name reminds me of that one show we tried to watch called Elementary, or whatever it was called. Eureka. Eureka? Yeah. Uh, actually, it is a lot like that. It seems there's people, like, in this science town doing science-y stuff. And their kids are all, like, mini geniuses, because, you know... <laughs> okay. Our next thing that we're gonna do is try and catch a, a ghost. What? Ghostbusters? Yeah, we're gonna ghost bust. Whoops. <laughs> Hopefully we win this battle because I don't think I saved. Oh yeah, so I'm pretty sure I did. <laughs> Let's hope I did. Oh the screen isn't sharing, let me fix that. Turn screen share, application window. There we go. A Meryl. Well, let's put our let's put some hope in Link. Interesting. Let's hope Link can do this. Believe in Link. This is a boy, so we do more damage. That's true. If you don't have many good moves. Though. What? Oh no. Oh, he held on. I was saying we don't have many good moves, though. Yeah, we don't. Try to use the Pokeball on it. It's that weird. <laughs> Weird candy on someone. Yeah, we I should. I don't care if it's someone else's Pokemon. <laughs> we could just be Team Rocket. We could be Team Rocket in a new place. Come on, we can do this. Yeah, I think we got this. Cool. Got it. Easy. Easy. GG, no re. <laughs> I'm a true streamer now. 
one theory sixty no scope <laughs> behind the back knife throw over shoulder blah 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 today Pokemon tomorrow Fortnite yeah Maybe God no Fortnite. no <laughs> play Fortnite together Zoe go Fortnite streamers oh no. Ugh. It'll be just like when you play League of Legends. <laughs> I love the Nidoran. You wanna get the Nidoran? It's ran off. Oh, do we have to find it? Yeah. Uh, it goes all around the city. No. What's that? You want to use the elevator? Sure, you can use it, fellow human. How do you entertain me with Pokemon Battle? Starly. Uh, let's get some experience on Link. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Hopefully Link can handle this. Well, that could have gone better. Back to Blaze. Switch up Pokemon every time so they can't hit you. Yeah. 20,000 galaxy brain. I took my child's Pokemon while he was at school so I could use them in a battle. An asshole move. I never battled before this, so actually, so I wanted to try it out. Not bad for my first time, huh? Oh, you can go ahead and use the elevator. What a, what a bad move. Back to heal. And off the, to the road again. And it's raining. <laughs> Why is it always raining? Uh, I think it was... What floor was it? Maybe second? Second floor for the Patricio? No, yeah, it was second floor for the Patricio. I think it's third floor for the ghost. Yep. Is it not here? Oh, I think we have to hear about the ghost first. So okay. let me tell you about the ghost. Can you believe... Then you can go what? <laughs> Hey Andrew, can you believe it's already been two hours? Uh, yes, I can. You want to uh, stop for here? Uh, you wanna find the ghost and then stop. Yeah, I think let's find the ghost and then let's stop. I think that'd be a good stopping point. Okay. Their floor is currently vacant, I think. I don't, think. don't mind me, just get. <laughs> okay, let's go check it out now. Is it a ghastly? It's a ghastly, right? Well, we'll see. Well, it's still not there. Any ghost Pokemon? No, it's a specific one. What if it's like a level 40 Gengar or something? <laughs> level 79 Gengar. <laughs> that reminds me, do you remember that one time that when we were still doing the Nuzlocke run of this? And we had to fight level 40 Alakazam? <laughs> That happened. One shot at us. Yeah. For you, I guess I should say. It's a shop it. You oh, came yeah, back. Right. At this time. <laughs> You're brave. Let's play. Get stabbed in the back, made into a puppet. 
Get a little shell bit. Uh, yeah. Let's just let's just throw a ball. Um, I mean, if we can't use scratch, if we try and use ember, we might kill it. That's right. What about Peck? Uh, what's his face? Yeah, Link. Link. Yeah, well, we can try Link. Let's see what happens. Link has a pet. Link has what it's called too. Yeah. The heck? He didn't even sure thing. He just made Link hurt. <laughs> That's so true. Okay, good. Oh, but oh shit! It has cursed body. That's a really good ability. <laughs> oh no! Can you do sucker punch? I could, but that would kill it. Oh really? It's dark is super effective against ghost. I know nothing about this stuff. I keep on forgetting about this stuff like that. It's okay. Oh, you got it. Nice. Nice. She called this one. I'm trying to think of a good name that's evil. That's a girl's name. Yeah. What was what was that one girl in Danganronpa? The crazy. Junko. I guess so. You want to call her that? <laughs> Junko. Uh, can I? That's really good. Let's call it Junko. You captured me at this time. <laughs> I like you. You're my master now. It sounds so ominous. It does. <laughs> Let's check out Junko's stats. That's really good. I like that. Uh, is it? It's really good, yeah. They got cursed body still, right? Yep. Still, still has cursed body. Cursed body makes it so that any, pretty much a move that hits it can become disabled. It is pretty nice. Okay. Um. Well, we did say we were gonna. We're gonna. We did say we were gonna end it after we caught the ghost. And here we are. <laughs> Yay. Yeah. How's our first? Yeah, we got our first successful stream done. All right. All right. Yep. Thanks for having me, Zoe. Mhm. Mm and, <laughs> and thanks everybody else. We'll be. I'll see you again on Monday for more Bravely Default.